So I was getting a squeaky 1246, 1247, bunch of iron, I already pulled out two nails, but then I get that. Hey guys, Josie Digger here. Uh, I am at the permission that I got from before. This is my fourth day here. And uh, I am today uh, just going in uh, Ferris coin, deep on, fast off, seeing if I can uh, get any of the deeper stuff I may have missed or stuff that was hidden in iron. So if I get anything good, I'll let you know. Alright, so I was getting a 1345, 1245 signal about four inches deep. And looks like off the side there. And that's silver. I got some water in my uh, my uh, pouch over here. I'm gonna give it a little wash off and uh, see what we got. Well, I knew some older coins had to be here. Look at that. Nice, pretty 1900 Barber Dime fourth silver of the year I'll take it I don't believe there is a mint mark on the back but it looks to be in pretty darn good shape I'll take it makes me happy get back with you when I find something else Alright, so I'm back over uh, for another lunch hunt today, and I've been over this little area right here like three or four times, because this tree is old and huge, and I just knew there had to be something right around it. So I was getting a squeaky 1246, 1247, bunch of iron, I already pulled out two nails, but then I get that. Could that be a copper? Looks like it. It's thick enough. Try to clean it off a little bit and get right back with you. Oh, there you have it. Definitely a large copper. See that one cent right there? I can't get a date off of the front yet. But it's probably going to be a matron head. Looks like it'll come in pretty good shape. So I'm sure, I'm sure I will get a date on it. And I'll get a picture up right after this.